Hello everyone, today I want to dive into the fascinating realm of human nature. I have a series of questions that have puzzled thinkers throughout time, and I'm here to share them with you. Let's unravel these paradoxes together. First up, why do we speak no ill of the dead but find it so hard to praise the living? It's as if death grants a person a halo, making us forget their flaws. But when it comes to those alive, we often focus on their imperfections. And here's another one. Why do old folks live in peace with the young but constantly quarrel among themselves? It's curious, isn't it? They cherish the youth but clash with their own peers, even though they become fewer with each passing day. Have you ever noticed how someone who leaves for foreign parts suddenly becomes beloved by everyone? But the moment they return, we're quick to push them away. What is it about distance that makes hearts grow fonder? And speaking of strangers, why do we go out of our way to help and praise a good man from another tribe, yet fail to notice the wisdom and nobility within our own kin? It's like we value the unfamiliar more than the familiar. When we're in an alien land, we can't stop praising our home. Yet upon our return, we sing the praises of the foreign village. It's a paradox of longing, always yearning for what we don't have. Why do parents show tender care to their small children but grow cold as they get older? The innocence of youth captivates them, but as children grow, the dynamics change. Have you ever struggled to gather your relatives for a happy occasion, yet they appear in full force at the first sign of trouble? It's like adversity binds us more than joy. And here's another interesting one. Why do your kinsfolk get upset if your horse wins a race? Perhaps success breeds jealousy even among those closest to us. In the past, people would remember a single act of kindness for a lifetime. Nowadays, good deeds seem to fade quickly from memory. Why is that? Why does a bay's son, when impoverished, find no shame in stealing but considers it disgraceful to serve another bay? It's a twisted sense of pride, isn't it? Why can't two good men in the same family get along, while two scoundrels always seem to make friends? It seems like morality complicates relationships more than we think. Why does someone whom you consider a friend turn away after receiving a gift from your enemy? Loyalty is such a fragile thing. Why do many of us turn friends into enemies over good fortune? Instead of celebrating their success, we let envy take over. Why do people seek advice from strangers but ignore the counsel of those who know them well? Familiarity often breeds contempt. And why do some guests act as if they brought all their herds with them? Yet when hosting, pretend their herds are far away? Hospitality can be quite the double-edged sword. People crave peace and tranquility, yet when it arrives, they grow weary. Is it that we only value what we cannot have? Why are the clever often poor? And why do the bold scoundrels rise to power? The world is full of contradictions. And lastly, why do Kazakhs ignore righteous words but revel in gossip and slander? It's easier to indulge in drama than to face the truth. These questions reflect the paradoxes of human nature. They challenge us to think deeply about our own behaviors and the world around us. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep questioning.